What is up, everybody? This is Craft 86 coming back at you on Modern Skyblock 3 Departed, episode 22. Okay. So, where we left off on was Batania. And I kind of want to automate this so we don't have to come over here and constantly be dumping stuff in there. But we do actually have... Let's see, where's my wand at? Right there. We do actually have a decent amount. It's actually almost completely full. Which is good. Haven't really done much. But I want to make it where this can be full at all times. So, I'm going to do a simple... Kind of a dropper... On it. Because I think I can actually use droppers now. Droppers. No. Droppers. Okay. I can actually make one of these. Precision dropper. Which there's two ways I can do it. I kind of want to try something with this one first. Because you need a dropper anyways. So I just need some cobblestone. And some redstone. So. Actually let's go ahead and just get a stack out. It's not going to hurt me. And I can get a stack of redstone. So, so let's go ahead and make a dropper. And what I'm going to need is... Got plenty of wood, so let's go and make a pressure plate. Now, I don't know if this is going to work, but it's worth a shot. Kind of a weird idea. I've never thought about putting it sitting up. Now, will it still spew items? It does. Huh. Well. But I'd have to reverse it. Hmm. So it does pop up there. So let's try something a little different. Let's go ahead and get all that. And I ate my... Uh, pressure plate. Oh well, no big deal. Now we're going to need more cobblestone. One of these gears, and I think um, was in here is all this stuff? No. Ah, uh, here's some of it. And we're going to have to make some <clears throat> oh, what do you call it? Ristonian crystals. Those are real easy to do. Use the atomic reconstructor. Throw it down, press a button, and these uh, palace crystals is actually lapis crystals being or lapis being thrown in there. And I'm gonna need some a piece of gold and some black quartz. Let's go ahead and get this going. made the basic coil. Now we're going to make the advanced coil. Now we're also going to make the rest. Oh no, I actually got my uh, piece back. Or my pressure plate. Now I wonder if I could possibly make this where it does the opposite. Hold the redstone to deactivate. So if I put that on there. Let's go ahead and put this up here so we don't accidentally throw it. Oh, we can't see it because of how dark it is. You know what? <clears throat> this has probably been on my to-do list for a while. Um, probably mob drops or farming. Oops, wrong one. Yeah. Oh, I need one more piece of string. No. No. Seriously? There we go. I don't have any string over there. 
probably have it over here. Oh yeah. Got plenty of string. Now I won't need this many beds, but just for the time being. Oh look, I'm gonna get an advancement made, sweet dreams. There we go. You see? Now that we can see it, it's just holding it. And it's not that bad. It's pretty easy. So let's go ahead and uh some of this stuff away. Let's go ahead and jump in our quest book because I want to get a few things done today in Botania. Oops, not party. Okay, we're working on mystical floral. Next thing that we need to make is the botanical brewer. So, This is right here. We need one blaze rod. Ooh, how are we gonna get a blaze rod? Flawless calculator later. Hmm. I don't know, maybe I have some of those laying around. Oh, wait. I forgot. I had a blaze rod from last time. Let's go ahead and put up the redstonian crystals. I don't think I'm going to need those. Um, one other thing I did actually do in between videos is I set up a few farms. You notice I don't have all this cactus and everything there, but look. I got kiwi. So. Notice all my farms are doing actually quite well. And huh, I guess those are just taking a while. Because I haven't seen a mystical flower. Oh, there they are. I could have just did that. So we don't ever have to worry about them ever again. Um, actually, if we go back to our quest and look at basic farming, I actually went through and uh, did all this. I mean, that was very time consuming. Let's just go ahead and claim all these quests. I'm just going top to bottom, or where, however. Yeah, this was just a pain. I just typed in seeds and started making them. This had to be the most grindy quest line I've went across so far. But hey, they're all done. Let's go ahead and put this up in our places for loot chest. There we go. Okay. Now, to make the botanical brewer, we're going to need basically what I have on me. Cobblestone and a blaze rod because we have to make a brewer. Which I can't say I've ever really used much of a brewer, but oh well. Okay, rune of mana. You notice I made that last episode. If I can remember which rune, I, or which one I put it in. Rune of mana. And we need some living rock. I think that was it, wasn't it? Oh, a block of mana still. Ooh. I didn't realize that. Um, just in case if anybody forgot, mana steel. Yeah, I only have 60 in there. Yeah, I also made some more iron. I noticed I was running a little low on it. See how our that's doing pretty good. 
and we just drop our iron ingots in there and let's see how much it took. Eh, not too bad. Let's go ahead and make the block of mana steel. Which mana steel can actually make some pretty cool armor. Well, I think it looks pretty cool. There's a lot of uses apparently. Yeah, see. I kinda wanna just make it and just have it sitting somewhere. Okay, let's go ahead and uh make the brewer. Trying to set you uh, let's say right here. Now this does need mana, and we could just basically go like this and toggle it to over here. Or toggle this back to there, it doesn't matter. So let's go ahead and get that one done. Or claimed. Where was that at? True magic. True magic? Nope. Yeah, I did those on accident. I was uh cleaning uh gems. And yeah. That is nice, I don't have to touch that anymore. Okay, we got that. Now, I kind of want to make, let's see, we can do a passive mana generation, personal managed storing device. So let's just go through this route. I don't know what the incense are for, but yeah, we don't need those. So, we need to make a band of something. Band of mana, band of... Here's a question. Did it take my... Oh, it did. I didn't realize that. It took my mana. So, three mana steel ingots and mana pearl. Let's go ahead and make up a few of these. Oh, I had 20 in here. Yeah, let's go ahead and make up a few of these. Five and three. Or five and one. One, two, three, four, five, one. Go ahead and grab some more living rock because we're gonna need it. Don't really need the sticks right now. Should be going pretty good. And I'll go ahead and kick off another one because I know I'm gonna probably need it. Go ahead and throw the stone and right click. Let's go ahead and make. Oh hey, I will see. Right click with an empty hand. That works. Okay, band of roar. Actually, let's read what this actually has it to cover. This ring of aura passively generates mana when worn. Oh. Okay. Um, I have a bobble slot. Let's go ahead and just throw it on there. Hmm. That's nice. Let's go ahead and get this one out. Maybe one more. Just to be on the safe side. Okay, that quest is complete. Let's go ahead and claim. And personal mana storage. Let's go ahead and uh, read what it says. Nope. This one. Make a mana tablet and a band of mana. Band of mana. So a mana tablet is eight. Well, I can actually just shift click that. Eight living rock around a mana pearl or mana diamond. But since we're going through so much, I'm going to grab some uh, stone. Because, yeah, we have used a lot. Okay. There we 
go. Now, while that's making. Okay, so that was that part. And now we had to make the band of mana. Pretty easy. Now, let's see where we are in this. Let's go ahead and claim this. Okay, this is kind of what I wanted to get into is elemental rods. So, type in just rod, you get like tons of things. But if you go type in at Batania, and then type in rod. Okay, let me eat something. Oh, I thought I was going to be a little more prepared on this, but let's go ahead and just uh, throw these in there for now. And the way the quest book states, you can make, you have to make every single one of them. Which, I don't mind, but I want the Rod of the Lands. I'll show you guys why in a minute. Let's go ahead and uh, vein mine that. So we get a little bit more. Basically, oh, that's gonna take one of each. Okay, we need a lot of living wood, which we only have a few. And it wants us to make how many of them? One, two, three, four, five, six. So I have to have at least 12 pieces of sticks. So we need to get an earth. Where are they at? Earth Ruin. And just basically do this. Now, the way this works, let's go ahead and throw our Banna Mana in there and switch that to filling that thing up. I don't know how full it gets. Get about half of it, and we'll pick it back up. Okay, switch it back. I did a pretty good job. I think we can throw this in another bobble slot. The way this uh, band or rod of the land works is it makes dirt for very little cost in mana. So that one is going in my bag. Because I'm getting tired of making it. Making dirt. Now, what else did they want us to make? Rod of the Sea. Okay, water and a water bottle. I don't know if I have any. I know I have glass available. But I thought I had water bottles available too. Go ahead and throw these in there. Water. And we can just basically... This one could be useful. It basically just makes water wherever. So. I might keep that one just in case. Like I'm doing something, I need water. That actually sounds like it wouldn't be that bad. Rod of the Sky. Oh. Ah. Rod of the Sky. Air and Feather. So, let's see. Uh, I know I have feathers in here somewhere. Did I put them in the mop drop? No. Oh, hey. I just realized something. I actually had the, those cores that I could do. Um, in here. Well, here's a feather. I don't know where all my feathers are. I'll figure it out later. Not a big deal. Oh, I needed the rune of air. I don't know what this does, but we'll find out in just a second. Let me get. Uh, I'm afraid it's gonna throw me. Kind of cool. 
I weren't really high, but that was kind of cool. Um, I might be able to use that. That would actually be kind of good to be in the nether. Or building certain things around here. Okay. That was pretty awesome. I have actually, I could say, honestly say, I've never made these before. Now, let's see. Rod of the Hell. Fire. Okay. Uh, blaze powder. You know, while I'm doing all this, oh, I might want to make up some more uh, wood as well. So I seem to be going through a lot of that. There we go. We'll just put this in here. Along with this, no, I want my sword. Along with the stone. Okay, rod of hell. Oh, fire. Nope, wrong side. And I'm kind of leery on doing this one. Oh, jump in the water. Okay, there's a cooldown on it. I don't like you. You're going in here, away from me. How much did that man did that take my mana down? Not much. But still, why catch me on fire? It's trying to kill me. Yeah, I notice my screen seems a little darker than normal. <clears throat> I don't know why. Um, my computer updated and I get this. So I'm probably going to have to go back through my settings and redo all of it, but it's not that bad. It actually kind of makes the grass and everything look better. See what our man is doing. Eh, it's not doing too bad. It's almost filled back up to where it was. Okay, so we made the Cursed Wand of Hell. Okay, Rod of the Molten Core. Rod of the Molten Core. Ooh, I need more. Well, man, I don't like using all my fire runes. But luckily, I do actually have those molten cores. I have four of them. So, I really wish it would tell you what it does. I should be able to click it in. Um. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Huh. Interesting. Okay. That could be useful. That's not like trying to set me on fire or anything. So I like that one. Rod of the Depth. Stone. Oh, we're going to have to make another fire one. A right, mana powder, mana ingot, gunpowder. I see. Mana powder. Was it mana powder? Yeah. So, some sugar. Go ahead and make a few of these. Oh, they already transformed. No. Let's go ahead and drop those in there. There we go. I know we're gonna need one of those. I know we need gunpowder. Nether wart, nether rack. Nether wart. 
didn't I have? Yes, I did. No, I just want one. So there's that, there's that, there's that. And what was the last thing I need? Mana steel. I think I still have some on me. Nope, I put it all up. Of course I did. And one of these chests. Or I used all of it. One of the two. Wait. Okay. That was strange. So we're going to need the water. Which I'll make some more of these between episodes. I didn't realize it was going to uh, take it all. I need two more twigs. And let's go ahead and get our stuff ready for because this one should be done. Wow. Okay. Now I should be able to click it in. Now I'm afraid. I'm going to click it on the side over here. Oh! That's actually kind of cool. Okay. That one's not that bad. I actually kind of like the Rod of the Depth. That gives me cobblestone. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Where did I put that wood at? I think I put it up. And one of these chests. Yes. I'm just going to make some more wood because I'm going to need a mana spreader and a few other things. There we go. Really should automate that, but I don't have the stuff I'd like to make to automate it. Let's go ahead and throw you in there. Okay, since we got that done, now we can go into the alchemical What's this called? Catalyst. Which I think that's... Well, I still have to make the Elven Time. Okay. Let's see what it all takes to make the Alchemical Catalyst. It's right here. Oh! Two brewers! Okay, nice. Thanks. I'm glad I had that one deal. Hey, look, I got both of them in one shot. Now, I just need gold. Do, 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 do. We'll make this and we'll call it a day. Was it one or two pieces? There's two pieces of gold. And there you go. Now basically this, I kind of want to have a separate uh, mana pool for this. Maybe over here. I think I have enough living rock to make a mana pool. The way this works, let's go ahead and break you and put you about here. This, um, all right, that's good. You can use it to uh, transform things, like, well, dirt goes into dirt. Um, sand goes into See, it can change the type of wood if I throw one in. That's what it does. Alright. Well, hopefully you enjoyed this Batania episode. And we'll still go in through a little bit more of it. I'm trying to go in a little bit more in depth than what I have on some of these mods. But if you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like button. And don't forget to hit that subscribe and that bell just to know when I make new episodes. That's if I can do this. Aha. Uh, any comments, concerns, or anything else, put down in the comment section down below. Um, until next time, this is EnigmaCraft86 saying take it easy. Later.